Hi guys, here's Spider Wicket with a quick tutorial. Uh, within my Discord, well, a couple of my Discords, that uh, people have been mentioning how they can, you know, eliminate certain audio from Twitch VOD tracks, you know, aka audio, um, music, sorry, you know, depending on, you know, if you're playing copyrighted music or, you know, you want to make a, um, a video or a clip out of your, you know, your stream. So what we're going to firstly do is go to OBS and then settings. Once this pops up, you want to go into the output tab and then you want to select Twitch VOD track here. And you can pick a number depending on, you know, which you want. For demonstration purposes, I'm just going to keep it as default number two. So I'm going to press apply. So I've got four tracks here, you know, audio devices coming in. So I've got alerts, voice chat, Spotify, and game. So for my Twitch VOD tr uh, track, I don't want Spotify. I don't want music on that. I want to make a video out of my, you know, my stream or uh, some clips. So I don't want music going on. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click under the audio mixer here and click advanced audio properties. So within here, as you can see, we've got all four of my tracks here. Then we've also got, you know, the different number of tracks here, one to six. I'm not going to go into the reason why, you know, to, into too much depth. Basically, you can split every single audio track up and have it multiple within a video editor. So you can edit up certain bits or make something certain louder. But we're not going to go into that in this video. Okay. So as I said, I don't want music in my videos, you know, my VOD tracks, okay, or my VOD, my Twitch VODs. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply uncheck two. Because we've listed that in the setting as one of our, you know, as our track for the Twitch VOD. So anything that's in 2 would be in the VOD. But anything, you know, that's not in 2, so for example, I've unchecked 2 here, the music will not be in Twitch VOD at all. It would not be there. So you can, you know, obviously review this footage. You can export it straight to YouTube, download it, make a video out of it, a clip out of it, whatever. It will not have that music, for example. And if you wanted to do the same for alerts, obviously, you know, simply uncheck two. So now your alerts, you know, your alert sounds won't come up within VOD stream. It will just come up on, you know, on the screen if you've got alerts enabled. You know, stuff like that. So that's quickly how you, uh, you know, eliminate you know, certain audios within the Twitch VOD track. It's as simple as that. So next time when you go live now on Twitch, you know, and you know, you're playing music through, don't worry about the VOD track. You know, it's not gonna it's not gonna be there. Your stream can still hear it. You know, everyone can still hear it, you can still hear it, but the uh, you know, your VOD track. The only thing you've got to notice, it needs to be obviously audio split up to be able to do this. So with the Wave 3, for example, you can come in as one device called the, you know, the stream mixer. And because, you know, for example, I've got game, alerts, music coming through, all the one thing, I couldn't split that up because it's only one single input. It has to be multiple to be able to select, you know, the different tracks, if that makes sense. But yeah, if you find this uh, tutorial really helpful or, you know, it's, uh, you know, done you some favors if you could uh, like that video subscribe if you like the content we've got more tutorials coming soon and i shall see you in the next one